In this video, we will show you how to create a bar fixed on model spline. What you will learn in this video is to create a bar on the fixed on model spline and how to do modifications to the bar. Just a small definition of a bar in Appliance Designer. A bar is a three-dimensional bar. It can be created both on a model set or another component in Appliance Designer. The bars are pre-designed in Ortho Control Panel where you can go in and make modifications to them. To create a bar, the workflow contains four steps. Once in Appliance Designer, you will click on the part you wish to build on. It will have a green outline. I will now right click and then press Create Bar. For coloring, I will choose this one and take a different color if I want to. Press OK and you can now begin to create a bar. In the first part, we can set the insertion direction of the appliance we're about to build. When I turn over the model and press Show Colors, it will give me all the undercuts of that particular model. If I want to change the insertion direction, I'll just move my model a bit and press Set Insertion Direction. And the undercuts will be different. If I'm satisfied with this insertion direction, I will press Next. To create a bar using fixed on model spline, first you need to create a central spline line. So I will turn over my model. I will create my central spline line like this. I will now press fixed on model spline and then I will have to do a spline wrapping around the central spline. Like this. Now I've created two spline lines, one wrapping around and one central one. I will press next. And in this part again, I can choose the different bar types. To be able to see your fixed spline line, you have to tick here and this will appear. To move the bar down, I will press shift and I can move them a bit down. To make a different kind of bar type, I'll press here to get another bar type. If I right click on one of the blue markers, I can set them all to move to common plane to get a plane like this. Again, you can move the different parts in here. And this is how you create a bar fixed on a model spline. Press Next. In this part, bar creation post-processing, it's possible to move the bar around using the arrows or the points here. Also in the left corner, you can see finalization. The first one is do not modify. The second one, you can merge the model with the upper part. This will take all the undercuts from the model from the bar. You can merge with the lower part or you can subtract the model from the bar as well. Extra combined do not work in this feature. Just press done. Once you've chosen one of the options, then your bar is finished.